Hey everybody! Welcome to episode 6 of the Schizo and Grimaldi Show. I'm Johnny Schizo. And I'm Mike Grimaldi. <laughs> and we got an audience. Let's hear from the audience. Alright, now that we have a live studio audience, this could get more entertaining. You never know. But we're going to interview another artist this week. We are. We're going to interview another artist. His name is Twisted Serial Killer. Yes. And we, we're going to play a little of his music, and then we're going to ask him some questions. Some that um, you know, some of our fans have sent in, just random stuff. So you have all the power to make this show better. Send us great questions. Go visit this ninja on Facebook. For me on Facebook. Visit this ninja on Facebook. Yes. He finally has a Facebook. I finally, I, I found the book of faces. And I opened it, and there I was. And I gifted my presents to you guys. This this wizardly beard and my awesome... This is going to be awesome. You're going to love it. Wizardly beard. Wizardly beard. And when we get... Where's your pointy hat? Um, With the stars you know, and the moons. It, it's cold outside, <laughs> so my hat... Call him Merlin Grimaldi. <laughs> I don't have any. Five Roman candles. Like, what do you think? Five Roman candles to like? Can I be like Merlin? Six. Six Roman candles. Woo! Or I'd be like six Merlins. Which that's a well, lot of Merlins. Uh, <laughs> Merlins gone wild. We're gonna play you some music from our artist. Yeah. <laughs> this will be before we call him. Yeah. Does somebody wanna. Press play. Oh, this is all complicated. <laughs> Can anybody press play? We need an adult. We need an adult. <coughs> we need someone to turn that on. And, uh... The phone? Yes. <laughs> Careful, it's plugged in. The button on the side. Uh... Here? Yeah, and then down one. Down one? Yeah. Woo Do you use once? On whatever it's on. Wow. <laughs> and yeah, just press play and then find the volume control on the TV. It's no. a remote over here. No, it's on the that knob down there. Yeah. This is twisted serial killer. Thank you. You can tell them now, they're listening. <laughs> um, Thank you very much. You should say hi. <laughs> yeah! Hi. <laughs> that meant to so tell How do we figure out how to call these guys where they can hear us? Um, speakerphone, and you just put it like right there. Like you move the camera a little closer and you just held it. 
Which really seems kind of we gotta we gotta be on and off the phone like three minutes, or your arms gonna cramp up, and you're gonna die. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. We're we're gonna have to, you know, Mr. Terry. Mm -hmm. We may need you for some kind of mouth to mouth resuscitation, cardiac, <laughs> in case he dies trying to hold this thing. <laughs> I may die. Gotcha. Did you guys see the? <laughs> that's great. I hope you saw that. Did you see that? What are we oh, doing? We'll find out later. Oh, we're calling Twisted Serial Killer for an interview. For an interview. And I have questions. We have questions. That's, yeah. Yeah. All right. Good job. I should probably set up, but I have these remotes. And this was one remote. This phone. And a coffee. We have to find a way to put this phone down so I'm not holding this phone for 10 minutes. No, no, no. Only three. Suck my it's balls. Almost, it's getting three. And when I say suck, I know we're not going to call Hobbs. <laughs> I gotta get to the T's, right? Yeah, the T's. T's for Hobbs? Alright, you should speak first so to make sure that he can hear us. Hello, praise. What's his name again? Uh, Twisted Serial <laughs> Killer. Good. Did you text him tell him we're going to be calling? Yeah. A long time ago. Hey man, what's up? Is this Twisted Serial Killer? Hello? Oh shit. Hello? What's up? Not much, man. Is this Twisted Serial Killer? What? Is this Twisted Serial Killer? Yes, it is. What the fuck is that, Tony? What's up, homie? Hell yeah. I'm here with my buddy Mike Grimaldi. We're doing our show, and this is our artist interview number three, and you are our special guest. And we are going to ask you some interview type questions and shit. Shit, that's just good, man. I used to be on your show, thanks for the interview. Hell yeah, no problem, man. Hey, uh, Mr. Terry, I think your buddy's here. <laughs> Sorry about that, we're having a little technical difficulties. Hell yeah. So, hell yeah. That happens. All right, so I gotta um, let's see. Can you hear me now? Awesome. All right, we we we've got some questions that we're gonna ask you that are sent in by our fans, and also we come up with by ourselves when we are left unattended. So I'm gonna start asking you some of these questions, and the world gets to hear them. You ready? All right, man. What is your inspiration? What is your inspiration to make your music? Honestly, I listen to, uh, listen to a lot of underground music. The Ranch, Eminem, ICT, Twister, Tom Off Things. Never to a lot of local shit. Probably anything that's real. <laughs> Hell yeah. Skitzo, you got a question? Yeah, uh... So how many albums do you have out, or how much music have you made? What? Fuck yeah. Right yeah. So how, how many CDs do you have out? Where is that? How many CDs do you have out? How many albums? So how long have you been in the rap game? Yeah, I've been, I, I've been, I've been at the rap game ever since 2011. 
started produ- start producing and making my own beats, my vocals at the 2012, and ever since then I've been releasing tracks. Fuck yeah, Ninja. That's the largest audience we've ever created. Oh. Hell yeah. Have you ever performed live? And if so, what's the biggest audience you performed in front of? Honestly, I performed a shitload of times in the Southwest states, mainly in Colorado, Gilmore, uh, Asland, Ogden. Shit, man, there's too much shows, but probably one of my best favorite ones is at the Roxy with Sam and LST. And nice. Joe Payne and SK doing a big for the college season for Black Christmas back in the day. You got another question for him, Grimaldi? Let's see. Yeah. yeah. Let's see. Shit, hold on. I'm trying to read some writing. So, what's your uh, what's your drug of choice? You smoke some bud or drink some alcohol or what? What gets you hyped when you're ready to party? I did every single fucking drug I get my hands up. Every single type of liquor fucking whiskey box or whatever, but my prefer a high, uh, shit, I'm a fucking, I'm a fucking drug addict, so, you know, I'm a fucking throwing shit to the head. That's hilarious. <laughs> awesome. I'm a rum guy. I love my rum. <laughs> Hell yeah, he's a, he's a drug guy. He said, it don't matter what drugs they are. Are they drugs? I will take them. <laughs> so when, when when's your next show, man? Tell us about your next show, where you're going to be. Tell us about your next show. Like, when's your next show going to be? Where are you performing? Most likely, I'm going to be at the Roxy Theater again with Storm and LSD. I'm hoping probably to do it for Blue Fest, something that, he, that Storm performs every year. And shit, with the whole concept, too, like SKR, and whoever's down with, you know, KYT, KCP, whoever's down to perform at Blue Fest and Black Christmas. Hell yeah. Oh, that's nice, yo. That's, that's the shit, man. Well, shit. Right. We got any more questions for us? I think we do. Ah. Do you prefer, like, when you're performing live, do you prefer to rap alone, or do you like to have a hype man with you? I said, when you when you rap live, do you perform to rap alone or have a hype man with you? What? Tell, uh, yeah. need to tell folks how to find the music. Yeah. yeah. Right on. So, uh, why don't you, uh, tell everybody listening that where they can find your music at? You can find my music on Google. Just YouTube, Twisted Serial Killer. You can find me everywhere. Red- Facebook, SoundCloud, MySpace, wherever the fuck. Twitter, you can find me everywhere. You can find me everywhere in Kill Colorado, too. Oh, yeah. Some water you can find him on Google. Google him on YouTube, and you will find him. He shows up pretty fucking fast, actually. Oh, yeah? Thanks, man. Hey, man, just doing it for the fans. Do it by wish, I'll be holding the rock. Yeah, man, I go by what I say. Hell yeah. Good, 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 man. We're looking forward to it. Hell yeah. And, uh... Since 2016 is just around the corner, 
with the shit's popping out. Joe Rada got to down. You know what it is, TSK, Chris and Stewart there. At the Skip Talk Show. Y'all know what that is. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> All right, fam. Uh, we're about to have to get on out of here. We thank you a lot for coming and being a part of our show. Oh, uh, yeah. He said peace out. That's when I stop. All right. I knew it was like a hang up. I wasn't going to start talking again. He peaced out. That's peace. Yeah, Whoa. that was Twisted what Serial Killer. You heard him Whoa. prior to the interview. That is his music. If you like what you heard or if you're interested in hearing it probably on a better quality, like your own computer, unless you're just a cheap bastard and you're using your phone, like I do. <laughs> Back this thing up a little bit. It smells great in here. It smells like pork. Pork's tasty. And what what do you guys think from our, our studio audience? Does it smell good? Yeah! Awesome. Y'all be jealous. They're going to get to eat my They're going to be jelly. <laughs> peanut, well, peanut, peanut butter and jelly time. <laughs> peanut butter and jelly time. Peanut butter and jelly time. Yeah, yeah. Wait, wait, wait. Man. <laughs> there's there's dancing going on over there. You guys are Let's clap the for the Let's clap for the studio audience. <laughs> yeah. Now, unfortunately, we're gonna we have to go. We'll, we, well, we're gonna have to go eat some pork. Yeah. But I will say this: it's delicious because I've already tried it, and I'll eat a bite for you. Because there's... So a lot. There, yeah, see, now I've helped. We're going to eat a bite for all y'all. Which, if y'all like, if y'all are watching this soon, like tonight or the next couple of days, that's probably only like a dozen people. So I can eat that many bites. Yeah. But like if I was like I famous like six of them. and there was a hundred million of you guys, and I couldn't eat a bite for all hundred million. Yeah. Of my fans. But there's not. There's only like... I would six, have to donate that 12. food to hungry kids because I'm a fat Sorry. kid and I'm not hungry a lot. I mean, I eat, but that's why I'm not hungry. <laughs> I mean, you know how it works. Exactly. <laughs> and uh, also, the the big announcement. You you want to? I got it. I got it. He's busy. He's busy gazing on this visage of awesomeness. We have a big announcement to make. A big announcement. The biggest announcement that we've ever made in all of this six of our shows and some little mini clips. And there's some of this dude on Facebook. Where he's God bless America and stuff. I mean, he's fun to watch. You check it out. You might one day. But no, we America. are we are working on Schizo and Grimaldi memorabilia that will be available if anybody gives a shit. Hit us up on Facebook. Let us know what you want to see these beautiful faces on. And also, I'm selling a genetic sample via a, a piece of my beard to the highest bidder. I get to choose the piece. Actually, we found the piece right here. That's it. That's my beard. DNA. Ta-da! So, anybody that, you know, <laughs> needs some awesome genetics, you can put it back in the case. It was with the collector stuff, like the gold doubloons and Billy the Kid's pistols and other valuable things. Salvador Dali's mustache might also be in that case. For only $3. Well, that's where the bidding starts. Let the bidding begin. We could get seven dollars if we let it just ride, because they have to bid. Or you know what we? Yeah, I'll talk about that. Uh, hey, you know what we should do? We should go <laughs> on a commercial. Yes, 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 yes. Yeah, we should go on a commercial. Well, no, we shouldn't. We're we're almost out of time, brother. Oh my goodness, the time has gotten away from me. <laughs> Now it's time to say goodbye to Schizo and all his friends. What friends? <laughs> Got a point. I even all get hate people, from the audience. All these people are your That's friends. All right. This is family, man. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, those guys. Family, not friends. And we have to Schizo go, and all his family. We have to go eat meat for them. 
So we're going to have to cut it short. Excellent. Well, all right. This has been episode six of Skits on Grimaldi. And it was an artist interview. Yep. See you next time. Same Skits on Top, same Skits on Channel. <laughs> we need a channel.